Hello and welcome everyone to another episode of the My HOE series in the CK2 Charlemagne expansion pack. So today we are playing as the lovable Count Augustine's son, who is married to the Countess of Wobblin of Gutton, who I am going to possibly put on the throne because I have literally nothing better to do with my life. Um... The problem with that is I just realized we don't have enough money if we were to do it to do much with it. Like we literally just get there and then like have no money. Which kind of does infuriate me but yeah we have no money to do absolutely any of the things we want to do. Um, and this person that we want to banish would only give us 5 gold. This would just cost us 20 piety. And he's the guy who slept with our mother when we were younger. Huh. You know, grudges carry very long in my family. <laughs> oh gosh. But yeah, our character is really good in almost everything. Um, leading troops and monster. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I'm leading troops in monster? Wait, wait. Is that the place right over here that just... Is that the place that's right now having battles? Shoot. I do not want to be leading troops. Okay, that is not good. By the way, dude, epic beard, but let's get it like, let's see if there's anything else we can get for you, man. Anything else better? Yeah. Let's get the goatee for you, dude. You seem like a more goatee, man. Alright. A child likes a guardian. Goodness gracious, who is it now? Lucky Star, all oh, the last child of my dynasty. Okay, well, yes, we need to definitely find you a educator. Okay. You know, Firstly, since I don't have any children right now, you could honestly be- I could honestly treat you myself, Lucky. Because I honestly don't have anyone. So, I'm going to tutor to the Lucky Star. No, 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 no. I will tutor the Lucky Star, because I know my wife will ruin it, because she's not actually that good. Yeah, give me that. There we go. And, over here, like I said, if I was to do this, I would probably- we could probably do it, we would just have to do it so quick, it would literally be a second. And that means I have to choose the cheapest retinue, which is going to be this right here. That means I could possibly do it for like, five months, literally, and then I'd have to disband, go after him again. Okay. He would call in all of his allies. Do I have any allies, actually, now that I think about it? I don't even know. I have the calling... I have the King of East Francia as my ally, what the heck? Well, if our realm becomes stable, I might go do this because I completely forgot I literally made so many allies with almost everyone in the world because, like, I know everyone. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, Waldrian is free. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to explain diplomatically why I cannot let him out. He slept with my mother. I'm pretty sure that warrants the fact he does not get there, but... Emigrid is going to be named Eva, just so, the reason why, by the way, the reason why I name my characters they, what they are, is so I can remember them down the line, be like, oh yeah, that's Eva, she was so-and-so, is she a genius, that's the first thing I look for, um, a message to end plot, fine, I'll end, wait, is, is all my plot value gone, yes, fine, I'll end my plot, I won't do it again, you can guarantee it, you can guarantee I won't do it again. Man, I hate that so much. Gosh dang it. Also, this guy I still want to declare war. Uh, must have a valid cause ability to declare war on. Mm. Apparently, I must have lost my, um, uh, thing. So, yeah, let's see. Um, I would personally love to have a son if that could be possible. Oh, it must have- Oh, I know who it was. It was for James. Oh, James had a had a daughter named Eva. Sweet. And his he's the princess of East Francia. Sweet. I do have an ally, which is good. Oh, I see. I see. I see what happened. The, the claim was really weak because it only had, like, one succession. I see. I see how it goes. I, 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 I realize what happened. Okay. Well... I guess it's time to do what I was going to do to from the beginning. Murder my wife. Which I can get 807 plot power for. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure she's dead. Like, this would be really... I would be really sure... Oh, 
Wait, 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 wait. No, cancel! Cancel plot! Kill the plot! <laughs> no! I will not kill my child! I will not kill my child! Okay? I, I don't mind killing my wife, but when she's with child, I'm pretty sure she gets a freebie for this. Once she has the child spat out, then we can talk about it. Let's see. You are a marshal of eight. He's a marshal of twelve. He's a better marshal than you. Alright. Oh my goodness, more people are deciding. Yo, you're, you're, you want to get court chaplain, which is learned. Fifteen, eleven. No, he's actually... Give... Give... Uh, I will... Hmm. Hmm. Who's my current one? I'm actually kind of confused now. He's the eleven. He's the fifteen. Oh, shoot. Yeah, he's better. Shoot. Yeah, my realm is... Let me just see. Who's the best one? I'm just going to pick these guys by naturally. Because I feel like if I keep doing this, this is going to mess me up. Spy Master, make sure it's not your wife. It's not my wife. It's a guy who loves me, so he's probably never going to plot against me. Steward Wise, who's the best steward? He's the best steward. He can keep his job. Marshal Wise, who's our best marshal? He's our best marshal. He can keep his job. Okay, there we go. We have absolutely the best people in our entire realm. And... It's a good thing, too, because almost all of them beat me in something, which is finally good. Goodness gracious, that took so long. It took us so long. Oh my goodness, Ambition finally came of legal age! Sweet! I didn't marry off Ambition, though. That's the only thing I remember. No, I did marry off Ambition. Wait, what happened to her husband? Huh. You know what? I, I don't want her to die off in the family. Uh, ordered to take the Oath of Vows. No, Ambition's too cool! She was like the one I was gonna plan to like do... Well... I was gonna plan to like... Like, have her do some cool stuff. But, yeah, no, 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 no. We just have to get some like... Landed title over here, make sure that it's... Not too close to the throne, because then they get all mad about you being close to the throne. I'm not, they're like... I'm, I'm imitating how they do politics in this time, people. Um, this guy should be good, and since he's 14, he should be fine. So let's arrange a patrol, though, between you and Ambition. Should be matrilineal marriage. There we go. Because he's the fourth or third son, and it would still bring her prestige no matter what. There we go, and then, let's see, is there anyone else we need to, I don't think we need to marry off anyone else but my family, which is good, because I literally have still one county after so long of scheming. Okay. And then, my current plot right now is waiting for my wife, uh, has filled the ambition to have a daughter. What? Shoot. Okay, I, I didn't know I chose to have a daughter, but... Her name will be Hera. Okay. Is she a genius? She's a genius! Okay, so she's a keeper. If anything goes wrong, she is a genius. So I can officially say that. And you know what? Let's try this just because I have a feeling this could actually work. Arrange a marriage between my daughter. Uh, no, wait. Oh, whoops. Arrange a betrothal between. My daughter of Hera, who's already a genius, may I remind you, and her? Aw, oh, dang it, they won't accept it. <laughs> okay, well then, shoot. I now have, yeah, let's have a son now. That's the one I wanted to choose, but apparently I didn't choose that. <sighs> okay, and I have absolutely no valid claims again. He's apparently, yeah. I have no clue how this succession is going anymore. The Duke. Let's see. It's going Popo. Then Eklard. Let's see. Popo is like. Let's see. Popo is this one right here. So this one right here could have a child. Okay. And then his brother. Whew, his brother has no children right now, so we could probably assassinate him. And then kill Eklard next. Yeah, but that's so much work, and honestly, at this point, uh, yeah, at this point, just, I'm giving up the ghost, there was absolutely no way I can do that, mm. but, 
Let's see, my claims, my chancellor, apparently my account, entire account is completely rearranged. Let's see, try to get claims onto, I guess, this province right here. Okay, you train troops in our original province. You build a, like, spy network here. And you just improve, or I should just say, improve relationships with the Pope. That way he loves me. Okay. Now let's get back to just my land. Because apparently Italy just like became the uh, cool guy of the cool kids and just like inherited a lot of stuff. Hmm. That's very interesting right there. Hmm. Let's see. You don't have any children yet. So I can't arrange a betrothal. Although, if he did have just one child one child, hopefully female. You know what? Actually, this would actually work out. If he has one child that's female, I'd be able to take advantage of that and be able to marry off him, maybe marry myself off, and take advantage of the political chaos that would ensue. Hmm. Interesting thought for thoughts. But right now, I have to still think of different ways to get into power. Hmm. I mean, I literally have the entire, like, lines and lines and lines. Perfect! Yay! Of people who love me. Oh, what? I could have broken up a fight. Yeah, let's try to become kind. She has gained the kind trait. Yay! Good job! I'm glad you became kind. And my wife... Wait, wait, my wife is no longer pregnant. What am I talking about? I could just kill my wife now. Good, okay. Okay, now that I... Now that, now that our child of Hera came out, I don't have to feel bad if I kill her. So, let's kill her off as quickly as possible. Order the Heads Knight uh, has arrested an armed man with ragged clothes. This is clearly a bandit. Um, count. Ooh. Lose? So. Oh, I see. Yeah, give me some piety. I don't care about the other people. Give me some piety. <gasps> Yay! And I'll go on a pilgrimage. Oh, yeah. While my wife's away, yeah. While I'm killing my wife, I'm gonna go on a pilgrimage. Perfect time. We're gonna go to Jerusalem. I'll travel to the Holy Land. Because my guy has done this before. He's a pro at it. Yes, he's gonna go to Jerusalem. He's gonna hopefully kill off people. And they say the lawless trip pay up. I don't mind losing some ducats. Failure. Uh, they, oh, good. She didn't uncover it. Oh my goodness, the flood? There have been strong rains that occurred recently in the area. Okay, building a group of farmers. Okay. Against the trade arbitrary. Bring the... Okay. Against the trade arbitrary. It is better not to... It has better not rain anymore. Order them to let the cats... Bring the farmers with all their animals. Let's try that. Okay, Jerusalem! Yay! I'm not getting this ready. Okay, let's hopefully this time, and now do I want to be a sympathetic of Judaism, or do I want to be a sympathetic of Islam? Let's go Islam, because that will probably be more useful, especially since... Oh my goodness, and I am now a pilgrim just like my father was before me. Huzzah! My wife is still alive, though. That's the only thing that kind of ruined this. And she's proving hard to kill, I mean... Hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, has inherited the barony of... <gasps> Wait, do I have to actually have land? Oh my goodness. I actually have land. I inherited a barony. Which means I inherited something. So, let's see. This guy is... Yes, the barony of this. Um, yeah. I own a barony, everyone. Sweet. Makes you feel very powerful. I own a barony! Yay! But we really got to, like, patrol, can marry. Um. Prince, ambition. Sure, yeah, because that was the one I was just going to kind of just give off. Yep. And thank you for the lovely marriage. Uh, is now no frequent someone. Okay. Come on, guys. She's gonna take a tumble. Now, please, for the love of Benji, kill her already. Who deserves the blame for this? At least she is. 
three attempts on this person's life. Wifey, stop. Okay, we're gonna try it again. We're gonna try the exact same thing. Wife, please die. I mean that literally. You have one state entry. Thank you. Goodness gracious. She was a. Ah. Uh, I can't even describe what she was. She was just. So, my wife is dead, which means now I need to find some new wife. Um, goodness gracious. I'm going to see if I can marry off, wait, wait, is this agnatic or cognatic? Agnatic, dang it! Why is all the calling dynasty agnatic? Makes me kind of mad. Okay, but, on a serious note, um... See, if I was to kill off them, no, I wouldn't go to me anytime soon. Okay. What I have to do is figure out a good line of people that are already like. Agnetic, cognetic. Okay, these are all agnetic. Oh, that's agnetic elective. That's probably never going to get to me then. This is the only line I can get to. And the only one I can do is Bernoff, Gumzel. This is Bernoff, that's Gunzel. And the other one. Hmm, well, I might as well start looking at other, these, some of these other kingdoms, such as the Norse characters. Well, I'm pretty sure I have Agnetic God Cag Cognetic. Hmm, and this person's not that bad. Let's see, let's arrange a marriage. Arrange a betrothal between me and them. No, why? Oh, marrying an infidel. Goodness gracious, I'm not that bad, though. I'm not that bad. Okay, so obviously they won't go for it. Hmm. This person literally has almost an entire... Oh, wow, we just changed rulers. It's East Aldolf of Francia. And it's Agnetic... Oh, my goodness! It's Agnetic Cognac Gavelkind! Shoot! That means... Technically speaking, that means finally women can inherit? So, it's first gonna go Coleman of Lotharingia. Okay. That's the first guy that's going to inherit, which he's the king of, of King Coloman of Lotharingia, as we just pointed out, because she's the queen of, oh shoot, if these two guys, if I killed my current leaders and got these guys together, that means these two realms would basically unite. Hmm. That's very interesting, but that'd be a very terrible idea, so I might want to kill that off very, very quickly. And let's see, next who would take over is... Giselle calling or Liquid Sind calling. Um, wait, are we going off of this family? Ah, Giselle, Prince, is it Princess or Prince? Because then I know instantly. Yeah, wait, wait. King call, is it Prince or Princess? It just says Junzel calling. Does he have a child named Junzel? No. Most likely, then it's his brother who I can't apparently touch, even if I tried. Well then, I guess the only thing I can do is just hope that one of these guys will die eventually from really malnutritious things. Or you know what, let's go start looking for another genius besides myself because I know how attractive it is to marry myself, but I can't do that. Look for a genius amongst the other people in our realm. And let's see what we can do. In fact, it could be basically of any religion and of any culture. Because as long as I make sure she doesn't be tutored by somebody else, I could basically make sure that nothing happens. And there's a genius and another charismatic negotiator. Uh, wait. She does no marriage. Ah, Well, that just narrowed down my options. Hmm. Okay. And she kind of has to be a woman. Just saying that now. Okay. And let's see. How many geniuses are there out in the world? Hmm. There's a strong... There's a genius. 49, though. Yeah, new. No. Let's just go back to our realm to see if there's any in our realm yet, maybe? Uh, 
Uh, I want to kind of get this done before we like end today's episode. Hmm. Well, that's attractive, but that's not good. Hmm. All right. Well, I guess I'll have to see you guys next time. I think I'll just work this out. On, bleh, on like not doing this time, but across from this time. During the in-between time, I'll work this out. So you guys don't have to see it next time, and we can just get back into the game. So I want to thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.